right, this is going to be my last summoning video, more than likely, um, for the foreseeable future. Pretty much, I'm done with the raid, and I'm probably going to move on to a different game. Probably Path of Exile 2. So, I would recommend that you unsub for me if you don't want to see Path of Exile 2. It was fun. I enjoyed playing raid with you guys and everything, but, uh, you know, despite everything, even... Even with the introduction of the new content, I'm just, I'm kind of just done for uh, multitudes of reasons, but the Hydra thing really just set me off and uh, I realized <laughs> a bunch of things. And I haven't been playing Raid for quite some time now. I've been taking time away from it and I honestly feel pretty good. I've been able to do other things with my life and focus on playing other actual games. And uh, Path of Exile 2 is coming on December 6th. I already pre-ordered it. I've been looking into the communities and it looks pretty pretty nice, pretty welcoming, pretty huge. It looks like the developers uh, care about their player base, actually listen to them. You know, as, as, as much as a developer can, right? Uh, I don't think I need to explain too much about it because uh, you could just look around and see which companies care, which ones don't. I'm not going to name any names. Bioware. <laughs> but yeah. Alright, let's see who we get. I've got shards on this account and my two other accounts, so I'm pulling everything. I think there's like, what, like a hundred on my other, on my main? So we're going to be pulling those. Hey, cold heart. But yeah, after this, I'll probably, I'm probably going to release like one more video. And then I think I'm just done altogether with raid uh, content. I I'll probably still play game. I, I might play it on my phone here and there because uh, sometimes I travel and I have to wait at the airport. Not much to do. But other than this video and the one that's going to come after this one, I don't think I'm going to be uh, doing any more raid content. Yeah. But um, yeah. Discord is still going to be open. If you have any like easy questions, I won't be logging into anybody's accounts anymore. But uh, like if you have, you know, simple like, oh, uh, how do I build a Krizia? You know what I mean? There's still people who's gonna who are gonna stay in and uh, you know hang out for the crew. But on the Discord, you're probably only gonna see a bunch of other games, especially for my other channel. So you know, I don't think uh, you'll be seeing raid content. But just letting you guys know. Let's see if we can pull any last legendaries, anything good. This is my wife's account. She stopped playing like a long time ago, but I was hitting clan boss for her and then logging out. But now I'm at the point where I don't even log in. I've uh, neglected that. Oh, miscreated monster. They did my boy dirty. But yeah, uh, in case you're wondering, uh, I just don't enjoy it anymore. And like, I, I'm doing YouTube because I enjoy it. I enjoy making video, oh, three epics in a row. I I enjoy making content, but if I'm making content for something that, or if I'm not, if I'm not enjoying the process, like I'm not really enjoying doing raid content anymore. There's no point in me doing this because, you know, I'm not doing it for the money. I'm doing it because I, I, I want to do something that I'm uh, happy with, or like, I want to put out stuff that I'm, uh, you know, proud of or, or passionate about, and there's just, there's just, it's just not here anymore with raid. All right, okay, so we're out of that. Uh, let's pull a ten pull here. Let's do a ten pull for the purples. Watch me get like a Yumiko or something, or like some crazy legendary champion. But even if I do, it's just like, it's gonna take way too long for me to really max them out. Wow, she got Seer. Oh, I think she already had that. Never mind. Plus, plus one Seer. I know some guys who have been trying to get Seer for like four years and hadn't gotten a single one until just recently. Kurzad. Not bad for the secret rooms. Put him in a stun set. Never used you before. And nope. All right. Well, there's that. Let's jump to the next one. Oh, let's pull some primals. Oh, wait. I missed it. But yeah, we're pulling everything, so it'll be fun. Pulling you guys anyway. Get over here. Watch me pull uh, some awesome mythical. I don't even know who the mythicals are. 
So it's like if I pulled them, I'd be like, oh, okay. Like I pulled the laws, but it was just kind of like, okay. And I haven't built him yet. He's just sitting there. But I guess that's, you know, the... It, it, it was going to happen anyway, right? Because, you know, everybody has a burnout moment, complete moment when they're just done with everything. And for me, it's six years. Yeah, I've been playing for six years. But the Hydra situation, uh, you know, say whatever you want. I don't care. But it, it's 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 how I feel about the situation and how it's affected uh, me. And at the end of the day, it's just like, if I don't want to deal with it, I'm, I'm not going to deal with it anymore. And so, yeah, I, I don't hit Hydra anymore. I don't... Uh, I've become so disenchanted with the raid ever since they they pulled that last Hydra stunt, and it, they, and then they they buffed it, but it they didn't buff it. I mean, they buffed the Hydra, but they they didn't rebalance it the way that we wanted them to. Like now it's it's like oh you can um, <laughs> free champion. It's like oh you can you can um, what am I trying to say? You can still do Hydra, and no more than three. Serpent's wills are going to be active at the same time, but I'm just like that's still not that's still not enough Hydra's not fun anymore. It's just a chore now it, It's it's not fun. It used to be fun. It's not fun anymore because they clipped like what half of our teams They still kept trend on on top for nothing. I Do like the fact that they lowered the um, The time limit that's a that's a huge win. I think everybody's okay with that. But yeah, Hydra's not fun anymore So I'm, I'm just done with it Pulling all these shards. If I want to pull shards again, I'll probably just hit up like H Dub and just you know see if he wants to pull shards for me. One of these days in the future. And no. You know, Genbo's actually okay. Pretty pretty beast for an epic early on. But yeah, I, I highly recommend that you just don't watch me after this unsub because the community here is going to change uh, i'm going to pull a darth michael transaction and uh, what the and just uh, switch to a different game so uh if you're going to play po2 poe2 let me know i could definitely use tips there because that game looks pretty fun it looks like what diablo 4 should have been because i really like diablo 2 and 3 played the fuck out of three with my brothers but um diablo 4 came out and we were just like well, what the shit is this <laughs> but then we saw a uh, gameplay for uh poe 2 and we were just like wow and then i started like watching um the devs talk to uh, other streamers and and youtubers like on a on a, on a more you know professional but still more personal basis because they're taking time out of their day to you know give one-on-one -on -one time to answer specific questions um, that the community has and like that's important and they do that on like a regular they've been doing that on a regular basis so it seems like they they care about the game that they have they're passionate about it and they're passionate about the community so that's part of why you know i, I want to be part of that i, I want to be part of that but yeah i'm gonna have like no idea what to do in poe it's gonna take some time for me to really hammer down uh and and get like a good idea of how to play the game um just because i've never played the first poe um i've seen some gameplay of it so if it's if it plays exactly like diablo um but i haven't played diablo in a while either so you know we'll, we'll see with that but I'm, I'm pretty confident it's something that i can i can really get into and sink my teeth into so we'll see december uh so december 6th but like it's it's mostly gonna be me learning the game and adjusting to the game i still don't even know how i'm gonna make my content on it it's probably gonna start off with just me like saying oh this is uh this is how i do this but not in like a tutorial style way it's just gonna be me like discovering shit so we'll see how that goes but if you stay and you want to hang out still and you know Maybe even convert to PoE too. Hey, okay. always appreciate it. But I don't want to shove content down your throat that isn't what you're here for, right? So that's why I'm saying, hey, you should unsub for me, because it's likely that you're just gonna not see raid 
stuff again after this video. Alright, any legendaries? Nope. It's cool that everything's on a 2x right now, so... Maybe I'll pull some back-to-back -back legendaries. Oops. I wouldn't even know who I, uh... I wouldn't even know who I would need. You know what I mean? Like, once you can do everything, it's kind of like, okay, well, I can do everything. I haven't seen anything about the Chimera that's about to drop. I've been seeing, like, in Discord and uh, videos. Uh, I'm not watching those videos, I'm just seeing the thumbnails. But yeah, I know there's a there's a Chimera coming up, and, you know, that looks fun. But it's still it's still not enough to, to rectify the situation. I'm done with the whole carrot and stick thing. Um, yeah, so... Moving on. End of Moonbeam. Because it's just like some of you guys said. If you don't like it, quit. Well, no longer walking the walk. I'm talking the talk here. All right, I got to make room real quick. Oh, I had um remnant things. That's pretty cool. Uh, let me just grab all this real quick. And before any of you guys ask, no, you can't have my accounts. None of them. I'm not giving them away. Still need something to do. If I'm like in transit, traveling. All right, the last set of blues before we move on to the reds. We're gonna pull our primals, and that remnant. I've got that remnant thing, right here. Boom! Watch there be a mythical out of this one. Nope, a mythical epic. Fang cleric, not spider. Well, I guess I could pull these guys too. We got Quintus. Nah, F it, let's do it. Yeah. Quintus. Woohoo. Yeah, no, I'm not I'm not gonna use you for anything. Even if I was staying. Because I have him on my, on my other account. I don't use him for anything. We're gonna pull one sacred. No sacred. Or no no Legos. He said, you're not getting any Legos today, burrito. None. Nada. You're gonna leave us? We're gonna leave you with nothing. Nothing. doing the we're gonna even it out even it out i realize when i talk sometimes like i slur my words i don't know why that is like i i need to enunciate further but like when i speak sometimes the words just kind of roll like i feel like i'm being lazy but then if i'm, I'm more concise and precise with I, those are the same words uh if i if i take more time to really emphasize everything that i say it just doesn't feel natural and it could just be because i've gotten used got see gotten gotten is the proper way to say it but i sound like a fucking tool if i say gotten like i really pronunciate my t's but have you ever met anybody like that who just like really says everything meticulously the proper way but then i i i like hear other people speak in in their languages and they also like slur their words too, especially like um, like really fluent native speakers will kind of just, what do you say? How do you say it? Like slur their words just as much as the Americans do. Most ones that I've met. Like I've seen videos of, of um, people learning Japanese, right? And so if you want to say sorry in Japanese, you say sumimasen. But there were people saying, um, native Japanese people saying, no, we don't say that. We just say, sumisen. Like, they just slur it. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, and then I'm uh, learning French, and it's the same same thing. So when I was in, because I studied, I studied uh, French in uh, Paris for a little over a month. And... Um, when you want to say something, when you want to say, for an example, like, oh, I don't know, you would say, je ne sais pas. But in Paris, when I was there, they were like, just saying, je sais pas. Like, they're just skipping, <laughs> like, the first part and then the middle part, which, you know, I thought that was kind of funny. And I'm pretty sure there's other examples that you guys could give too. So, yeah, well, look at that, back to back. And it's not even a 2x for the primals. Walking Tomb Drang is actually pretty good. Like, I really like him. And then Ray is obviously pretty nice. 
Ray's bae. I love my wife, though, so she's not that bae. Here we go. Mythical. I wonder how many points I'm going to end up with after this. I don't even think there's a, a point to try to win the uh, the tournament. I remember at one point during COVID, I really wanted Seeker because he was key to make the unkillable team. And I've pulled like a hundred of him. It's just it's just so funny. You, you get the one champion that you really want or really need to make something happen. And then after that, you you just they, they just give you him over and over again. Like, oh, you need Enda Moonbeam to fuse Mikage? Yeah, we're not going to give you uh, Enda until you pull, like, I don't know, 50 more shards or something. Or, like, 500 more. And then after you get Enda, they're like, alright, now we can raise the drop rates back to normal. And then you're pulling Enda Moonbeams moon, moon beams left and right. Come on, give me a Lego. Always thought he was kind of cool. Aider, a tour. Maeve. I never used the sisters. Like they were never good enough for me to want to be like, oh, hey, I'm gonna use both of these guys together, or both of these girls together. See, another seeker. All right, what am I getting? Oh, then, oh, Maeve, they have the sister. Perfect. Other half. Who's this? I want to cut it up and, and cook it ribeye steak style type shit. All right. Definitely not a Lego. Almost looks like Knight Errant. Errol or Knight Errant? Wait, which one? I forgot. Ah, I don't know. Jintoro. Their animations are the same. I just realized. Royal Guard. Probably plus something you. Although I, I think you only need one. Royal Guard. No, that's not true. The, the average player probably needs like maybe three tops. Three built out if you want to like nuke some dungeons down probably get away with two if the, the gear is there and the, and the setup is there hey watch me pull harima loving this 2x i don't even know how many shards i pulled how many how many uh how many shards have i pulled oh this is he's kind of cute He's got like a like a belly. Hope is a trap. Too many books, in my opinion, and her cooldowns are still not good. Masamoto. He's like a mummy. Ruella. See, she looks cool. Especially with all this extra stuff here. But she's just not. She's not cool at all. Not useful for anything. A fat crit aura. That's not high mother mouth. Kaiden. Where's your gems, boy? Where's your gems, boy? Fat man. Got two left, boys. And girl, girls. Either or. You know, you know what I'm trying to say. All right, this is the one, guys. This is the one. For something. One, here comes the two to the three to the four. Tell them bring another round, we need plenty more.